Trump raises over $4 million cillion in crypto for campaign, mostly Bitcoin. Hongji Fang last updated. July 25, 2024 at 2338 GMT3 One Minute Read. Former. President Donald Trump has so far secured over $4 million in crypto donations, predominantly in Bitcoin. According to a recent report published by CNBC, Trump's campaign has raised substantial funds through contributions in various digital currencies, including Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple, XRP, and the stablecoin USD Circle. Tyler and Cameron Winklevoss lead Bitcoin contribution, a federal election commission filing of over 1,000 pages detailed the Trump 47 Joint Fundraising Committee's activity from April 1 to June 30. The report showed it raised over $118 million with distributions to the Trump campaign, the Republican National Committee, and other entities. At least 19 donors contributed more than $2.15 million in Bitcoin. These donors come from 12 states and include various professions such as homemakers, military officers, missionaries, and State Department security technicians. Crypto billionaires Tyler and Cameron Winklevoss contributed 15.57 Bitcoin, totaling over $1 million per donation. However, because their contributions exceeded the $844,600 limit, part of them were refunded. Additionally, BitGo CEO Mike Belshi donated $50,000 in Bitcoin. Brian Hughes, A. Trump campaign aide confirmed that most of the $4 million raised in crypto came in the form of Bitcoin. Crypto innovators and others in the technology sector are under attack from Kamala Harris and the Democrats, stated Hughes. While the Biden-Harris administration stifles innovation with more regulation and higher taxes, President Trump is ready to encourage American leadership in this and other emerging technologies, said Hughes. Kamala Harris may be more open to crypto, Mark Cuban. In an email interview with Politico, billionaire Mark Cuban indicated that the current vice president Kamala Harris, endorsed by President Joe Biden, could be more open to crypto. The feedback I'm getting, but certainly not confirmed by the VP, is that she will be far more open to business, artificial intelligence, crypto, and government as a service, said Cuban. Changing the policies changes the message and lets everyone know she is in charge and open literally for business. Follow us on Google News.